Meghan Markle is one of the most famous people in the world today, but not everyone knows that she had a marriage before meeting and marrying Prince Harry. Her ex-husband is Trevor Engelson, a film producer and actor-manager in Hollywood. They met in 2004 and married in 2011 in Jamaica, but after two years, they divorced due to irreconcilable differences. Trevor Engelson has been silent about his broken marriage with Meghan Markle, and never commented on her new life with Prince Harry or their departure from the British royal family. However, he may not keep silent forever, as there are many agents and publishers offering attractive proposals for him to write a book revealing secrets about Meghan Markle. According to author Neil Sean, who wrote the book The A to Z of Harry and Meghan, Trevor Engelson may consider all options and decide to share his story. Neil Sean also said Meghan Markle was very afraid because Trevor Engelson had direct experience of living with her when they were married. If Trevor Engelson decides to write a book or interview about his failed marriage with Meghan Markle, it could cause a big shock to the public and affect her career. Neil Sean said Trevor Engelson's book could go into detail about Meghan Markle's ruthless and ambitious personality, as well as why he was dumped by her. Meghan Markle and Trevor Engelson split up when she starred in the famous lawyer series Suits. She spent most of her time filming in Toronto, while Trevor Engelson stayed in Los Angeles. According to author Tom Bauer, who wrote the book Revenge, Meghan, Harry, and the War Between the Windsors, Meghan Markle wanted to establish her permanent home in Toronto instead of moving back and forth between the two cities like other actors. Like Meghan Markle, Trevor Engelson also remarried. He married heiress and nutritionist Tracy Courland in May 2019, a year after Meghan Markle married Prince Harry. Trevor Engelson could be the next person to tell the truth about Meghan Markle, after she was criticized by many people in the British royal family and the public. Whether he will do so or not, let's wait and see.